Hey guys, so we're going to be doing a bonus reading for the sign of Capricorn today. Um, you guys had quite a bit of views on your weekly reading and I wanted to give you guys a um, bonus reading. Um, if this video resonates with you, I'd really appreciate it if you like, comment, share it, and subscribe. And I do offer private readings, so if this video resonates with you and you want um, more information on your personal situation, there's information in the description box on how to book a personal reading with me. Um, I also will be extending this reading, so if you're interested in a, diving a little bit deeper into this reading, the link to the extended reading will be in the description box. All right, guys. So let's see what's going on with my fellow caps. What's going on? See if anything has changed since the weekly reading. Um, a lot of karmic cycles are closing out, and it's because of this full moon um, lunar eclipse that we're about to have on the 26th. Okay, guys? So that's been coming through in all of my readings. So let's see what's happening here. Oh, you guys have a love offer coming towards you guys. Someone's going to be offering you some type of love, emotion, could be dealing with, we have water energy here. So some of you guys could be dealing with the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or they're just embodying that energy. Um, we also have King of Swords here. So you guys could be dealing with someone um, that's an air sign, okay? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, that's only going to resonate for some of you guys. Um, this You guys could be dealing with somebody that could have been very um, blocked or closed off with their emotions, very much in logic. Um, before a little bit guarded um but now they're maybe wanting to offer you some type of emotion or commit or i don't know i'm not gonna say that yet this person has gained some type of new perspective here with the hanged man and they're deciding to close out a cycle all right there, there's some type of cycle of burdens that this person is ending and it may be to bring this offer to you yeah the world there's a cycle closing out for this person this person may also want to travel to you Eight of Swords. They've been trapped in a situation. They're putting that to an end. The Tower. Yeah. A foundation. Something that was long standing or some type of like foundation that was in their life is coming down. It's crumbling. It's ending. Justice. And it's it's it, it's going to be karmic justice. Okay. Guys, for this, this foundation to crumble or for this ending to occur. We have the Chariot. And then this person's going to be moving on to something else as we see here. That could also, again, be travel. I'm getting travel for some reason. All right. All right, what's the Knight of Cups, Spirit? What's this love offer, or offering of emotions? The wheel of fortune the divine is guiding this person to offer you something or the roles reverse the roles um as need be okay this person has been you and this person probably have not been in communication or this person has been taking some time to he heal spend some time in solitude but i feel like that's going to be changing they're coming out of that and they're going to be bringing sorry guys bringing forth an offer here what's the knight king of swords This person may have been guarded because they felt, um, let me get one more card. Uh, yeah. So compare, so this person was feeling like a page. Okay. This person was guarded and they may have been a little bit scared to open up to you because they felt like a page. They felt like they didn't have very much to offer you. Um, they think of you as the nine of pentacles. They think that you guys are very abundant, successful, independent good all on your own and that's a little bit intimidating to them it put them in this fear mindset a little bit worry anxiety um and maybe that's why they were being that's what was going on with this air energy okay this person that's maybe not that emotional but what they don't know is that what i'm being drawn to here is that you were you're already at the nine of pentacles you only need one more pentacle to put you at the ten and look who has that one pentacle they, they it's like they're the person that could It'd be like the, the cherry on top. Like, I'm not explain it exactly, but they they are enough. But they weren't seeing it that way. What's the hanged man? All right, that's a lot of... Someone is having gained a new perspective or someone's been taking a pause to gain new perspective, but they've been manifesting while they've been taking that pause. And they're wanting to do the right thing here. They're wanting to bring justice or balance back to a situation with an apology here or an offering of emotion. What's the Ten of Wands? Yeah, someone's ending a cycle to have a new passionate beginning. What's the world? 
They could be ending things with an er another earth sign. Um, so a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, or they could be ending a cycle so that they can focus on stabilizing their life, okay? Becoming more grounded. The world, yeah. Something's ending with an earth sign, possibly. I don't think it's you guys. Yeah, something that's been a burden. What's that mean for, yeah, there's an ending here for sure. We have the Ten of Wands, we have the Ten of Swords, we have the world twice. It could be something to do with their mental stability too. They could be ending a cycle to regain their mental stability. Um, because we have the Eight of Swords here, we see that they've been trapped in a situation. And the Eight of Swords can sometimes be a mental prison, okay? What's the Eight of Swords? Judgment. Some type of decision is being made. This person was very up in their head about some type of decision. Or they couldn't... They're gaining clarity. Yeah, the moon. They were in some type of illusion here that they were trapped. Conflicted. Mental conflict, conflictedness. Or they were afraid of a conflict here. But they've been doing a lot of healing and soul searching. And it's helping them to free... It's helped, They're freeing themselves now from this situation. What's the tower? Yeah, they grew tired of a situation. Something was just very exhausting. A cycle was bound to close out here. It's like something that they were taking too long to make a decision. And it may have... Something happened. Oh, you know what it was? Is that they were not able to see... That's what I'm saying. This person was in delusions. They were not able to see the past clearly. But the... They were not able to see things. Something in their in the past really broke their heart, okay, guys? And it was um it was causing them to not be able to see the see things clearly, okay? What's the justice card? Eight of Swords. Yeah, this person is it's like this person is getting justice. Or them coming forward to you is gonna take you out of a mental prison of anxiety, fear, worry. Um let's see, justice. Queen of Pentacles, yeah, that's your energy. I feel like this person is trying to get up to your level because we have the king and queen of pentacles. This person's trying to free themselves from this other situation so that they can match your level. Oh, hold on, guys. This person has a lot of regret. This person may have been feeling very pessimistic about you guys being able to come together in a union here, but they're seeing things differently now. With the hanged man, they've gained a new perspective here. What's the chariot? Yeah. Yeah, so this person is moving towards you for a new stable beginning because they've gained that new perspective. And they want to collaborate with you now. They want to work on something with you and they want to have balance with you. They want to have re recipro reciprocity with you now. Yeah, this person has had a lot of obstacles that they needed to go through, to get through, to get to you though. Um, they're going to fight for you is what I'm saying here. All right, let's see if there's anything else that I need to clarify. <sighs> Tell me more about this Ace of Wands. Yeah, this new this new passionate beginning is coming in quickly, okay? This person's feeling very drawn to you and they're feeling very um, passionate about you. All right, yeah, this is more indication right here. Eight of Wands. There's going to be quick communication coming in here. Quick progress, quick action, all right? All right, guys, that's what I have for you. Like I said, I will be um, extending this reading. So if you're interested in that, the link will be in the description box. But if not, thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.